Hi, you guys are in for a treat. I'm going to show you my Xperia X1 with the new X2 customizations via XDA developers. Now then, here is my main regular titanium Windows mobile panel. As you can see, it takes a while to load. Roaming here, I've got a few customizations in right now. The battery there. There we go, we're all loaded. Now then, not too slow, a bit snappy after the first start. Unfortunately, it's a bit slow, so we just have to return to Fido. Now then, let's try out uh, panels. Shouldn't take too long to load up, usually after the first run. Perfect. I've got my Windows Mobile panel, Fish panel, the Tile Wave panel, that's what everybody here is all about, right? Tile Wave. City Night. City Day, Growing Panel, CNN, Facebook, and the Media Experience. Now then, I am running a few X2 drivers on my X1, so it's quite fancy. And let's go to see the star of the show, the Tile Wave Panel. As you can see, everything's been preset. I've just recently input the registry settings that Ethermind has helped us out with. It's going to connect to data to automatically get weather information. So I'll just show you right here. It's connecting. It's connected. There we are. So this is one of the tile waves main functions here, how it flashes around. Alright, so the weather is obviously updating. It's taking a bit longer than expected because of my poor signal. There we are. Just like that. Beautiful. This tile wave panel. And by pressing the city, I can simply change the location. Hong Kong. Las Vegas. Tokyo, Japan. Now back to Vancouver. See, so far I have made it so that, well, that doesn't access anything yet, but I'll show you the calculator. Perfect. So let's say five times uh, five times or two is equal to ten. Nice animations there, right? Perfect. So I have RSS feeds running. I've got Pocket Now and Gadget. Gikyong and Kotaku. I mostly look at the Engadget ones though. So, I have contacts here, I'm not going to show you that. I've mapped it so that the Sony Ericsson button opens up the camera application. Of course, through the camera application, you won't really see much since it's so dark in here. You see the orange light of my Sony Val powering on and off. Alright, let's exit that. Back to the tile waves. It is really beautiful, isn't it? Alright, let's see what it looks like this way. There's a bit of a lag there. Sometimes there's distortion at the top. That doesn't happen too often. Unfortunately, you had to see it. And through settings here. Nice animation, huh? You can change the weather. Choose your web feeds and pick the location where you want your weather to be taken and the time zones. Looks like it's fixed itself up. Let's just wait to see if any animations occur while we're on standby. Normally one or two things happen. I'll have to see what happens. There you go. So the tiles begin to shift on their own automatically. It's pretty nice. I mean, <laughs> well, all of this wouldn't have been possible without the help of those chefs at XDA. They really got the stuff going. So again, there's a bit of distortion at the top. Just trying to fix things up. Alright, that's it.